tornado unboxing. Remove all parts from the packaging with care and compare them to the list to ensure they are complete. Step 1. Install the front wheel. Remove the plastic axle guards from the front wheel, being sure to not touch the brake rotor set. Next, align the dropouts with the axle of the wheel hub to make sure the fork dropouts are fully seated on the axle. Carefully lower the fork and ensure the brake rotor goes into the caliper. Open the quick release skewer and remove the thumb nut and cone spring. Install the quick release skewer starting from the brake rotor side of the wheel. Tighten the thumb nut and then use the palm of your hand to close the quick release skewer. Step 2. Install the handlebars. Remove the four screws from the stem and ensure the liner markings on the handlebars are centered and the handlebars are adjusted to a comfortable position. Finally, tighten the screws with the assembly tool. Step 3. Install the saddle. Next, insert the seat post into the slot. Adjust the saddle height to a suitable height and tighten the adjustment nut. Step 4. Install the pedals. Note that the pedal interface will be marked R and L. Thread the right pedal onto the right crank gently by hand and turn clockwise. Install the left pedal in the same way. Please be careful to turn counterclockwise. Both pedals should be tightened to 35 Newton meters by using a torque wrench. Step 5. Install the fender and headlight. Install fenders and the headlight. Attach the front fender and the headlight with the screws. How to start and stop your e-bike. To start the e-bike, press and hold the battery switch button for one second. Then press and hold the M button on the handlebar for three seconds. To turn off the e-bike, press and hold the M button on the handlebar for three seconds. How to open headlight and rear light. To turn the lights on and off, press the button above the headlights and the button below the rear lights. How to remove the battery pack. When you want to take off the battery, insert the key and turn it to release the battery pack. The battery pack can be removed and charged separately. It's worth noting that please read the owner's manual carefully or consult a certified local bicycle service provider for assistance, in addition to contacting KBO Bike for help 